Was there was there anything in particular about Luca um, that you know he did? You felt like he did differently, or like surprised you at all? Um, no, not no, not really. I think sometimes him being so close to the rim, you know, because they space out. You know, when they put Cleaver in, they space out. Like him being so close, and he's just he's big, he's tall, he's strong wide and like his pace like his real like he can slow step so slow and get you just to leave your feet and it's over so sometimes I think we did so well it's just like him really being at the rim and then like you just naturally see him right there and you just like look to go see if he's about to make the shot and the dude would just skip that shit across the court and you just be like turn around wide open three you know what I'm saying like I know he got the ball a lot and stuff like that, but I, he helped his teammates just get rhythms, even though when he might have had a layup or, or a little midi or in the paint. Like, so I give him credit for that because that was, that was different because that was messing me up sometimes. Obviously, I got better at it like during, this, during the uh, series, but that whole thing, just slow one two one and Still doing all, everything he's doing, and then still finding people when he has a lot of them there. So, yeah, I think I, we actually I talked about this with Mark Jones on the broadcast of Game Six in Dallas because Mark Jones made the point with Jalen Brunson and a lot of Villanova guys how they always play off two feet. You know, they play out of their pivot game. Um, they they don't get caught up in the air, you know, and, and with no real plan and and sort of making the decision in the air. And Luke is sort of the opposite of that. You know, he's really as good as anyone, especially going to his right hand, where he'll do one, two, slowly, Mm -hmm. get up in the air, and he is looking at everyone's head. And if your head is on him, he's whipping that pass. The other thing that was really impressive to me, uh, and and again, he did this even in the the Warriors series, was when he is making those kickout passes, they're almost all. It doesn't matter if he's throwing them behind his head. They're almost always on time, on target. There, sure. there, there's no high pass, low pass. Like there, his percentage of on time, on target pa- passes in traffic is impressive. 